find another way out for now for now we'll just go with this we need dirt here and then redstone I need more redstone And then dirt. Right there. It should then bring it down to here. That I could redstone, or that I could power. And redstone here. I didn't do anything. Is it powering itself? Crap, it is powering itself, isn't it? I bet if I remove that one and that one. What the heck is it powering itself off of? There. That is where it's powering itself. Because it's coming back. Round. Oh. That is annoying. Alright. Alright, so that powers that. Do I? So here comes my problem is I need to put that on a switch. An RS North switch of some sort, which means I almost need to put it over here. So we'll put. up there. Alright, so need dirt here, torch there, redstone there. We'll get rid of this torch. We need a block to power that and I need pistons. I need pistons. I'm going to need four pistons. Alright, so... Let's fill up cobblestone there. And I need to get iron. And we're going to throw that there for some stupid reason. I'm just going to junk everything extra in here for now, except I need the smooth stone. And then I'll get what I need out afterwards. But I still need the food. I just don't need to carry all this crap. Um oh, torches. Okay. Pistons, that's what I need. So I need iron. And I need wood. And yeah, we'll do it out of the darker wood, I guess. Let's see, so I need four. And they don't need to be sticky, so thanks for that, because I'm friggin' 
out of slimes. Slime balls. I need to go f get some more of those now. All right. Now the reason I'm doing four is because I need two RS Norlatches. I need one for each mode. So I need one here, which will go here, here. up in a bit. And I'd like to have this supercharged if possible, which means I gotta have a powered line to it. And we'll figure out how to do that. But I hope I have more redstone. I can't believe how fast I'm going through redstone. So that then will go back and forth when it's got power to it, which is something we'll figure out eventually here. Um, and it'll power those. This side then is, um, oops, yeah. We need to bring the power down for that one. Eh, crap. Okay, so bring that down here. We're just gonna have to keep bringing it down. And I think this way. Getting dangerously close to the water. <laughs> Same thing here. Hole there. Oops. Redstone wire. Torch. Block. We'll do the we'll do the uh, deeper piston on that side, so we don't have to dig out more sand. Like that. Two more blocks. Boom. Boom. All right. So now, I'm going to get this one's going to be easy because I just keep bringing it this way. And at some point, it's going to become super powered, which I could probably do right here, actually. dirt. Is 
So then that becomes super powered, comes over here, and powers that. Easy as that. So that's that one done. And that should now be on a switch. On this switch. So if I hit that. There. Brings them down. Hit it again. Brings them up. Alright. So now I gotta get this switch wired up. This one's gonna be a little more tricky. I tell ya. Alright. So we already have it brought down, but we need to bring it down one more step. And then we need to charge it, which we can do here. And then that should hide that. Nope, can't do that. Because it shorts it out. It's completely hidden inside. Okay, good. Hmm, hmm, <laughs> I need to somehow power this line. Unless, there's a way to do it this way. Nope. Oh, you know what? Maybe... Maybe there is. This would be a weird trick if it worked. Nope. But, I bet it works this way. So, nope, it doesn't work. Weird. Ah, mystery, mysteries of redstone. Too bad this didn't work. <laughs> this. Actually, I wonder what that does. Nope, that doesn't work either. Now one thing I can do is I can take this Invert it like that, and then that should work. Let's see, that might be the way to do it. So now there's <laughs> now I can't get down there anymore. So hopefully everything is right. Oops. So there you go. Flip that switch. It brings up those. Flip that switch, and it brings up those. Shut. It doesn't. That doesn't do anything. What the heck? Oh, there you go. That was strange. Strange. So there you go. My enchanting building is now variable. With switch, with buttons. Now I'm going to collect some more of this. Although I don't know why I'm collecting it anymore because I've got enough bookcases. Alright. 
Now, um, man, this thing needs work. I got chickens escape. He escaped. Chickens escaping. Pigs escaping. Why are things escaping? Get back in there. Animals escaping everywhere. I need to make that bigger or something. Improve that on that somehow. Now, there you go. I got that done. <laughs> I'm pretty proud of myself there. So I've got that done. I have got this done. So it's all piston powered. I mean, I'd have plenty of melons. Um, oh, yeah, here's something else I did off camera is I put a little ledge around so I can walk around here. There's a creeper in the hole. Creeper, what are you doing in the hole? Oh, huh, creeper. Creeper in the hole. So, the other thing, and I wish it wasn't raining in the game right now, because it'd be easier to show you. The other thing I want to do is, you see... Um, first, I want to... I need to fill that in. But You see that beautiful structure up there? I'd like to build something up there. Um... I don't know what, and I should get out torches so I can make a light way up there. So I can light my way up there. That's what I'm saying. Ah, I thought I had that jump. So I'm thinking of building a path up this way. Up to that. Somehow. And, uh... Up to that and building something up there, maybe like some kind of light tower or um, a beacon of some sort. Something that makes it obvious, hey, here's uh, here's where Michael lives, type of thing. And uh, I haven't been all the way up there yet, but it's not easy to get up there, you see? <laughs> it just drops right there. But get up there would be nice. And get something built up there, and get a like a, a walkway or a bridgeway or some way to get up here. Let me walk around this way. Let's see what there. But see, there's more here. More there. But yeah, look at this. This is just crazy. It's like a rock floating on top. Oh, hello. I saw you about ready to jump on me. I took care of you. Never understood why their experience go flies with them when you knock them back. Oh, look at that. Cool. Not that I need it, but... Anyways. I don't know an easy way to get up there. I might have to build a way up there. just rain would stop. It's easier to show stuff off when it's not raining. Alright, I think I'm finally up here. Maybe. There you go. I made it. So yeah, I'd like to put something up here, because look at it. There's my, my base down there. And there's this nice flat area. So I haven't figured out yet what I want to put up here. Hi, Creeper. Oh. Okay, fine. I give up on you. So let's put some light up here. Um, I'm thinking it might have to be some sort of lighthouse. And I didn't bring anything with me to start with it, but 
That's okay. Um, yeah. That's what, I'm gonna, well, that's what I'm gonna do. And let's get this little walkway out over here. To all this stuff over here. It's pretty amazing. I like it. I like it a lot. And I don't know why none of that is loading. Parkour. So, I'm gonna get your guys' advice. Cut it off here. I'm gonna head back down. If I can find a simple way down. Uh, figure out how I should make... Or get your guys' advice on how I should make the... Uh, the way up. You know, should I do... Um... Oh, hello. That's right. Man, his experience fell all the way down there. Um, yeah, so how should I do the way up there? I mean, because I need an easy way up there. And, uh, and probably continue this way. So should I dig through this right here and then have uh, some stairway up, some suspended stairway or something? Or what should I do? Because I've got this, and I was thinking maybe continuing from here, going up, and then up to here somehow, up to there somehow. But uh, I'm not sure yet. So I'd like your guys' uh, input on that. And that's it for me for now, for recording. And hello, chicken. You know, I'm not happy with you. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I'm an asshole. Um, so that's it for me. Thanks for watching, and uh, see you next time. Hello, everyone. Michael here, back again. And, uh, yeah, I am recording. But, uh, quick update here. This is after, um, the last few episodes, or actually the last episode in this one, I believe, because I'm going to have this at the end of 172, are, we recorded before the dragon fight, and now, <laughs> so, the la it's, it's weird, but the last few episodes have were recorded before the dragon fight but I wanted to get the dragon fight out right away so I pushed the other up behind blah 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 so here's what's been going on I guess pause didn't want to be here um I took the levels that I got see here I am still in my gold but mostly broken armor from the dragon fight but I took most of the levels and I enchanted a new pick which is right here unbreaking three efficiency three um, so that's what I got, and I've been working on farming Darkwood right recently. And, uh, let me show you what I've been working on as well. Um, after farming the dragon is I replaced, first thing I did is I replaced all that dark wood with, the, or with the dark logs with the dark wood planks to kind of match the rest. And then... Yeah, you can kind of see it out there in that window, but I come up, I've come up with a design, I think, for the uh, roofs that I think I like. And there it is. Um, it's kind of, I, I kind of like that. Um, so I think I'm going to continue with this design. It's kind of a stepping design. Like that. But continue it with the, uh, the rest. It, it's even got a little bit of a ha overhang which is kind of neat. I really like that. And then inside, this is what it looks like. Inside. Although, I may... I don't know, I may redo inside and actually make it so the ceiling is flat inside. I haven't decided quite yet. Because, I, well, I don't know if I like that or not. I haven't decided yet, like I said. So, we'll figure that out. That way the ceiling doesn't seem so tall, but... It actually it feels good in here, doesn't it? It feels, now that it's enclosed, it actually feels bigger for some reason. Now it's got something on top. Um, 
But yeah, I kind of like it. So I think I'm going to continue that with the the rest of the buildings. Uh, the main house needs a little bit of re... Because it doesn't exactly match the rest. But it doesn't have to, I guess. But I still want to put that this roof on top of that. And then also on top of that building. That building. And way over here. That building. Which... I don't know if you could tell, I've been doing some landscaping. Throwing down, you know, throwing bone meal down on the grass every once in a while. So get flowers and tall grass and throwing up a couple trees. Stuff like that. Start getting reeds coming all the way around the water there. I need to, I ran out, but now they've grown some so I can harvest all these and continue it along. I'm getting the trees planted here and stuff. And then the enchanting building, which we just watched me build. And uh, with the different options. Push that one. That, you know. The different options and stuff. So, there we go. So, that's just a quick little update I wanted to throw on the end of this episode. I will uh, do some more. Here soon. Just wanted a quick little update. So I knew what was going on before I recorded my next set of episodes. And uh, that's it. So I'm going to off camera. So when you see I mean next, I'm going to have this design of roof on top of all the buildings. Um, I'm not going to bore you guys with all of the just placing the blocks because it's just half slab and then full block and half slab and full. It's boring. Who needs to watch that, right? So, that's it. Thanks for watching. And uh, I will see you next time.